Morning everyone. Back down on the strip. It's a weekday, actually. It's a Wednesday, uh, just after Memorial Day. I'll tell you what, they had a great Memorial Day here in Las Vegas. I heard there was 330,000 people here, which is pretty much almost a sellout. And then Monday, uh, going home, folks from California, there was a 17-mile backup just to get out. Hey, it's all part of the experience. But I'm down here today on the Strip. It's morning. I can smell the coffee, the bacon, and the toast cooking. And uh, I'm going to check out the link. We were here a couple months ago, but they were doing a lot of construction. And uh, I want to see how much uh, they've done. So this adventure starts right now. We are down here for the link today. Lots of other stuff we could have seen. I'll tell you what, I walked through the Palazzo and it was amazing how they've uh, fi fixed it up for summer. It's just gorgeous. But we're going over across the street. We're going to the link. Here we go. Across the street. The link is a 2,640 room hotel, casino, and shopping promenade on the Las Vegas Strip. It is owned and operated by Caesars Entertainment Corporation. Last time we were down here, there's quite a bit of construction. There's a couple other things we want to see down here. From what I understand, the Link Hotel is incorporating holograms now into their uh, hotel. And I'd like to see some of those if I could. But we're here. We're on the Link. And there's the high roller. Hotel and Casino. I'm just gonna go check, see if there's any holograms like they were talking about. Okay, check this out. I don't know if you can experience this on film, like I'm experiencing for real. But this is all immersing. It is a hologram. All right. Well, so far that was it. That was the only hologram I saw. <laughs> But I am told that there are some more, maybe from the Harris entrance or something. Anyway, let's head down the link. Here's the entrance to the Flamingo. I'll show you a little something here that you can do in the Flamingo. And this is right off the link as well. This is the side entrance going into the Flamingo. If you walk down this hall, as you come in the entrance, walk all the way down this hall, past the buffet, and almost to the casino, you come to the Flamingo Habitat. It is literally just a few steps off away from the uh, Link Promenade. You just come in the uh, Flamingo side door, walk past the buffet, turn left outside, and there's the Flamingos. And they've got ducks on the other side. Okay. Even a turtle over there. And this is just before you get to the pool area at the Flamingo. It's a beautiful property. Seriously a beautiful property. And uh, if you just go up those steps over there, and right in front of the chapel, there's a um, memorial to Bugsy Siegel. I did that in another video. I'll link to that video. We're, this is just a quick run through here of the Flamingo. All right, let's head back to the Link Promenade. A lot of great restaurants here. The Tequila Bar is right here. O'Shea's. They have a beer pong and all kinds of drinking games in there. O'Shea's. It's really a great place. And of course they serve Jameson. Why wouldn't they?
Here's another restaurant. It's called Off the Strip Bistro and Bar. And of course, my favorite store is Gorham Brothers Hat Shop. This is where I get my uh, feathers for my hats. Love Gorham Brothers. Gift shop next to Gorham Brothers. Of course, there's no traffic on here. You walk, you can walk freely and not worry about getting them running over. Another restaurant on this side. This is called Virgil's Barbecue. Never ate in here. Never ate in here. It looks really great though. Full bar, live music probably at night. And always, the big wheel staring down at you. On the other side of Virgil's, it's a tilted kilt. Now I will say we did eat in there and did not have such a great experience, but I wouldn't, you know, say that was just one time, so. And if you look right up there, that is the pool for the link looking over uh, the Link Promenade. Pretty cool. This area here where the fountains are, they actually sometimes they put a, a platform over this and they put bands in here. We heard a great uh, band, uh, a Queen uh, copy band. Oh my gosh, they were so good. There's the American Beer and Cocktails restaurant. Burritos. Sprinkles, great cupcakes. Right next to Sprinkles is Brooklyn Bowl. They have live music every night, and you can actually bowl while you're listening to live rock and roll. How cool is that? Oh, this is new. Jimmy Kimmel's Comedy Club. Never saw that before. Check that out. See what it says. All right, looking back down the link now, uh, this is heading towards Las Vegas Boulevard. You can see that they have a zip line. I have recorded this a couple times. I go the zip liner. But it's cool, imagine zipping your way across here, all the way up here, and then you end up right there at the big wheel. How cool is that? Let's keep walking. Good place for breakfast. You can 
see the cars. How slow they move. From what I understand, it's a half hour uh, rotation from beginning to end. Lots of construction over here. This is eventually going to be the Caesars Forum Conference Center. It will be 300,000 square feet of flexible meeting space with the two largest ballrooms in the world, all conveniently located with direct access to Harris Las Vegas, The Link, and Flamingo Hotels. Meet the future, Caesars Forum. Straight above me here, this is one of the monorail stops and it does stop right at The Link. So if you do take, well, there's the monorail. Oh, talk about the money shot. <laughs> there it is. It does stop at the link. And we're back out on the strip. Carnival Court. For Harris, this place rock and rolls all night long. This is where the bartenders uh, spin and twirl their bottle. There he is, he's doing it right there on the screen. Cookie Jar used to play here a long time ago. He was great. Right across the street you got the Forum Shops and Caesar's Palace. And this is Harris. And this is the link. And there's one more thing I want to show you before we leave the link promenade area. This is a brand new bar that they just opened. It is brand new. It's called Rematch and it uh, overlooks the Las Vegas Strip and of course Caesars Palace. This is the way it's going to be here in Las Vegas now. All these outdoor areas. It's really great. I think it's great anyway. Got lots of games in here. Cool little bar. And they have, they have the hologram thing going too. Little DJ stage. And look at it, look how close you are to Caesars Forum Shops. And we're back on the link. And Margaritaville. being a little bit short over at the Link Promenade and I parked over at the Palazzo not because I'm cheap because it's free but uh, I parked over here because it uh, doesn't cost any money <laughs> and it's free it is quite a walk but doesn't cost me any money uh, this is their latest uh, summer edition here and it's just gorgeous and I couldn't pass it up I had to show it to you
right, that's going to do it for today's vlog. I uh, hope you enjoyed yourself. It was a nice, beautiful morning on the strip. I had a good time. It was kind of short down there at the link, but we did fill it in. Wait, wait a minute. Stop, 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 stop. Dale, stop. Uh, we're actually not done right now. We're actually going back to the strip tonight. Here, uh, you're going to explain it to yourself right now. Well, guess what? I signed off this afternoon, and uh, we decided to come back down to the strip. Paula's with me this time because uh, there's a party in the park, and we're going to do it. They get to do it every uh, Tuesday and Wednesday here, and we've never gone. So we are down here, Paula's with me. We're gonna see what's happening. They have band playing, there's all kinds of food. Uh, here's, here's Paula. All right, I think we're gonna get something to eat. I think we're gonna go to the uh, California Pete's Kitchen. We like this place. Okay, Paula, what do you got? This is garlic chicken with vegetables. Looks wonderful. Oh, it's gorgeous. And I'm having uh, cedar plank salmon and some kind of a salsa thing with the feta on top of it. It looks great. All right. yeah. We're heading down to the party in the park. Vegas Golden Knights, that's what's going on down here. I tell you, the party in the park didn't turn out <clears throat> the way we expected it to. We thought it'd be pretty crowded, but we are on the Las Vegas Boulevard right now. We we'll just pan up here, MGM. Tropicana in the background there. And then uh, right across the street, New York, New York. And the roller coaster. They have another stage down here. And there's live music playing down here, too. All right, I think we're going to close it out. What do you think? Yeah, it's been a long day for you, especially being down at the link earlier. Yeah, actually doing two vlogs here. Of course, we didn't do too much down here. We did have good dinner, though. Yeah. And nice band, but I couldn't play any of it except for the ending of their song. So <laughs> uh, we'll find out what their name was, and we'll put it in the, we'll put it in the link. Uh, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed, please subscribe, and don't forget to hit that no notification button because then they'll tell you when our next video comes up. Hope you had a good time. See you next time. Bye-bye, everybody. everybody.